Hey, good day. It's Greg Stadler here again. Just wanted to give you a real quick tip. I'm up here in South San Francisco at a produce company, and I had to come in and uh, do my normal tests on the sodium hypochlorite, which they use in their flumes and in their uh, in the chillers. So I just wanted to give you an idea. If you don't have a dosatron or you're considering one, uh, number one, you should always make sure that you understand how this works. Now you can see hear the one clicking here in the background. And uh, we'll take this one as an example. This is actually a stroke pump up and down inside of here. So every time it clicks, the pump is changing direction. So it's not, you're getting a con continuous flow of water through the pump, but you're not getting a continuous flow of solution out through the output. It's actually pulsing in the sodium hypochlorite. So in your uh, flume or in your washer or what have you, it will eventually, uh, uh, mix really well but when you're testing it's very very important that you understand that if you just take your 10 milliliter beaker and come up here and, and take a small sample you're not going to get an accurate reading so number one when you install these you always want to make sure that you put in a filter in line a pressure gauge in line as you can see here and then of course um, here's your output which goes up into the uh, plant and here's your test port which is just a simple uh, additional T valve here that allows you to uh, turn this on and I'll always pull a minimum a minimum of three gallons of solution and to make sure that it's mixed properly and that I'm getting an adequate amount of sodium hypochlorite in the sample so we're gonna take a sample here we'll shut that off and now I'm gonna go down and I'll take my 10 milliliter sample and I'll do my titration. That's it, my friend, a good quick tip. Make sure that you understand you need to take an adequate sample in order to get good readings. And that's it, my friend. If you've got a food plant or you'd like some additional training for your crew, by all means, uh, click the button down below and I would love to schedule an appointment for either myself or one of our consultants to come out and do a site survey and help you out. That's it, my friend, until next time, we'll see you very soon.